What's going on guys? Today I'm going to show you how to put on a Senna headset on a three-quarter shell helmet. The only tools you're going to need is a 2.5 Allen key. So the headset I'll be putting on today is just your basic Senna headset. This one is capable of connecting to your phone and four other Senna headsets. It doesn't matter what model they are because I also have a Senna S or 10S which is on my full face. This one connects to the live wire on my Harley and if you need to know more about that go check out my other video. I did a review on that. So this one I'm connected to my three-quarter face because every time I'm wearing this helmet I'm always with my girlfriend who's riding on the back with me and I just need to talk to her. I don't have to call out through the bike. So let's go ahead and get this put on this helmet. Helmets are held together by duct tape and zip ties. <laughs> Not really. They're actually held together by uh, Velcro. So the first thing you want to do is remove the neck collar. This helmet just has a metal wire inside this one that just kind of snaps in place. Once you get that out of the way, you want to go ahead and remove the padding where the speakers are going to go. This one just has two buttons and they just pop right out. Once you get those two ear pads taken out, you want to go ahead and get your mounting hardware for the Bluetooth on to the helmet. And that's really simple. You grab the, your 2.5 Allen key. You got these two screws right here. And you just go ahead and just loosen them up a little bit. Which therefore will make this plate move back and forth like so. And you want to mount it on the right side of the helmet. And there's usually a gap right here between the padding between the padding and the helmet. You want to slide the back plate right in there. Gotta loosen up just a little bit more. Slide that over. And then once we find a good spot for it, we'll go ahead and just tighten down those screws. Now that's nice, nice and tight and secure, we have to run the headphone or the ear speakers and the microphone. Now, most helmets have inside of them, right here, you'll see this little black thing. That is where the speaker will go. And there's actually Velcro, not Velcro, like a soft material there. And on the back side of the speaker, it is, oops, see, it's stuck to the helmet. It's actually like a Velcro-ish material. The speakers are going to come in two different lengths. You have the short one, and then you have the long one. See how much longer it reaches? So the short one obviously goes closest to the headset. You just stick it on the Velcro, and that one's done. Take your long one, run to the other side. Stick it on that Velcro, and it's done. Now you gotta take your mic. Now the mic also has the Velcro side. You just wanna place it somewhere where you want the mic sticking in front of the helmet, like so, somewhere right about, somewhere right about there, but it's also flexible, so it's not uh, that hard to get into the right spot. I'm just gonna take mine, and I got, a nice spot right here by the chin strap. I'm going to put it right there. And that's it. So now I just go ahead and snap the buttons back on. The ear padding buttons. Tuck some wires away. Go. We're going to take these wires on the back side right here and we're going to hide them. We're going to tuck them up underneath over here. We're going to go ahead and snap the other one. There's one, there's two. Once you get the speakers in on the ear holes, you snap them back together. Go ahead and tuck these wires away right here. And then grab your neck piece. 
and just place it over the wires. Make sure you're in the center for the reflector strip. Snap them into place like so. Tuck some more wires away. And then that's it. Now you got a nice clean installed headset on the helmet. You got your microphone right here. Very easy to just move out of the way, up, down, doesn't matter. And you're able to talk to four people while you ride. Alright, that's it for now. See you guys next time.